years ago, I ended up camping out. Gotcha. Iron Man. So, yeah, the place where we can go. So that would be the Forest Service, Forest properties, and BLM properties up to 14 days at one location. Yeah, that's yeah. So, so the nearest BLM Forest Service property is basically going to be the top of the mountain here. Yeah, that's that, BLM. But here in uh, the month, it's going to be shut down for wildlife restrictions. Yeah. What does a visit by Steve mean for you? For me? Yeah. Well, usually it's, I'm usually doing something wrong at some point. <laughs> <laughs> It just, uh, he comes here to make sure everything's all good, checked up, everything's all being covered up, not trash all over the place. When I was up here this last time, we had about 10 people total, 10 or less, and they diverted themselves over to here from Purple Cliffs when, it, uh, when Purple Cliffs closed. So we're working on trying to get them relocated. And most of them were offered, you know, homeless shelters, Volunteers of America assistance, all that. But unfortunately, they all had problems that prevented them from being in those locations. I.e. felony, uh, vicious crimes, uh, or they did not want to self-admit into the homeless shelters because of their habits. And of course, our shelters are dry shelters. Uh, so you cannot you know, use alcohol drugs and whatnot in those shelters so th this camp itself was not occupied for at least a year it's been basically a dumping site uh, the camps that we're running into up here the 10 or less people they're day campers they set up their green tent be one or two individuals and literally bounce around up in this area